Rich, last year you were the first free agent starter off of the market, and uh, you guys had some other question marks as far as free agency was concerned. This year, not so much. You guys didn't have a lot of holes to fill, and it's the same group of guys. When you walk into this clubhouse, how excited are you to uh, head towards 2018? Yeah, everybody in here is very excited, and you know we didn't have a lot of time off, which is a good thing. So uh, getting back in the clubhouse and seeing everybody and. You know, everybody's really excited, looking forward to 2018, especially obviously coming off of uh, the way we played last year. Um, but yeah, it's, it's great seeing everybody and, and uh, getting, you know, how everybody's off season was going and, and looking forward to uh, getting, getting everything started again. When we talked to Andrew Friedman and I asked him about the left-handedness of this rotation, the starting rotation, he said that's a surface way of looking at it, that you guys are all very different lefties and you can equally get righties out as well as lefties. Your thought about this rotation in general as it stands right now? Yeah, I think it, we're in great shape. Um, you know, obviously the biggest key is always health and everybody in this rotation, uh, speaking of the rotation, knows how to handle themselves, knows what they need to do on a day-to-day -day basis. And that's, that's one of the things that uh, we, we bring back into this clubhouse for 2018 is the experience. And everybody can draw from that experience, from the rotation, uh, to the guys in the field, to the bullpen. So it's, it's uh, a well-rounded team. And uh, again, the experience is extremely deep. A couple of new bullpen arms for you guys, and Scott Alexander, Tom Kohler, who potentially could make some starts for you guys, kind of making that transition from starter to reliever as well. What do you make of those arms and those additions? I think it's great. I mean, we, you know, filled, filled needs where we needed them, and um, uh, just two, two really great guys that we, we were able to uh, put in, in in addition to obviously a, a team that is extremely well-rounded and, and uh, just looking forward to getting to know these guys. And that's part of the spring training too, uh, right, is getting to know uh, the new faces that are, that are in the clubhouse and, um, you know, really just, just finding out about each other. You guys are constantly tweaking things in this spring training. Is there anything in particular as far as your pitch selection that you're working on or anything that uh, you want to achieve before we hit break camp? No, just continue to stay aggressive. And, and you know, obviously I've always, I always preach stay in the moment, enjoy, you know, every single day that we're here and uh, go out there and, and get after it every single day. That's it. Finally, for you, Rich, I know that in speaking with Rick Honeycutt as well as Dave Roberts, they're backing you guys off a little bit and having more of a recovery in between bullpen sessions. Just your thought about that plan. I think it's it's uh, you know obviously a good idea to uh, come in and 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 you know have a little bit of a you know uh, subdued start. I'm not subdued in the in the sense where everybody's taking it easy, but um, you know in my case I I'm ready to pitch whenever whenever they give me the ball and you know um, just again is everybody has a little bit more time uh, to get ready for the season, but also remember that when it is you know our time to take the ball is to go out there and 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 you know get after it.